file management an introduction class 2 computer rahul needs to store his school assignments where he should keep it in a folder what is the need of using folders folders help us store and arrange our files systematically match the given files with appropriate folder now think why do we need to keep the documents in the particular subject folder so that we can find them easily learning objectives components on the computer screen opening and closing an application creating a file in an application saving a file in the specified path and its purpose when the computer starts it shows a screen it is called a desktop you will find many small pictures on it these are called icons some icons on the desktop represents an application a file or folder an application is a program that help you to do specific tasks example paint a file is a collection of information for example the above pictures represents drawing file a folder is a collection of files for example the above folder contains a number of picture files the start button is present at the bottom left corner the long horizontal bar next to the start button is called the task bar small pictures representing a program on the desktop are called icons after you start the computer you open an application to work on some commonly used applications are paint word pad notepad or calculator let's learn how to create and save a file in applications for future use introduction to word pad word pad is a basic word processing program it is used to type text such as letters poems stories reports essays and much more it has more options than notepad to start wordpad type wordpad in search button click wordpad from the search list the wordpad window opens look at the wordpad window tabs contains commands that help you work in the wordpad these are minimize maximize and close buttons ribbon contains various tools and commands and working area is where you can type text to create a new document click file tab click new option a new word pad window appears you may start typing in the work area A font is the style of letters you type. To select any font on the home tab in the font group, click the arrow next to font. It displays a list of all available fonts. Select the font. Font size is the size of letters. To select font size on the home tab in the font group, click the arrow next to font size select a font size from a list of font size displayed in the font group other formatting tools are bold italic underline strike through text highlight color and font color you can observe the effect of each tool 
To save a file, click the file menu. Click the save as option. The save as dialog box appears. Choose a folder where you want to save your file. Type file name. And click save. The file will be saved in that folder. It is important to save the file with proper file name, as it helps to search the file quickly. To open an existing file, click the file menu. Select open option. The open dialog box opens. In the file name box, type the name of the file. Click the open button. To close the document, click the file menu. From the drop-down list, click exit. Or click the close button on the top right corner of the window. Recap WordPad and Notepad are used for typing text on the computer. You can use different formatting features to make your document attractive. You can save a file and open anytime for future use. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to stay updated. Your comments and suggestions are valuable to us.